always be with you. Chairman Park Hangil. Please give him a big hand. Please welcome him. Hello everyone. I can feel like uh, the very active uh, movement. We have a, a new 7,000 chairs. We bought new 7,000 chairs, but we couldn't really use them at all for the seven years. But I can see a, a large audience. I can feel like uh, it's like the Success Academy that we have, uh, that we used to enjoy before COVID-19. And the government announced to lift all the limitations for big events. Now we can actually have offline events like, like uh, before COVID. So you have faced a lot of difficulties, but still you didn't uh, give up when the big is really, really strong. Your kite would high, fly higher. So, and as the kites, all Atomians have become even more successful even before the COVID-19, the difficulty, and we are renewing ourselves day by day, and this innovation would continue every day in the future as well. And this changing, fast changing world, actually we need to move faster than those changes, and that way we can survive the changes. Now, when we saw many successful people, new leaders, Royal Master Chang Heran, and many new leaders. Congratulations from my deep, deep heart. And Jadik Malay for Malaysia, Crown Master for Malaysia. It is astonishing. So we have a Crown Master outside Korea, Jadik. Thank you for your effort and congratulations. I believe we will be able to see an uh, even brighter smiling face from you. Now, because of this COVID-19 pandemic, uh, actually the far distant future have come to us uh, earlier than we expected. The online activities, uh, many experts predicted that the online world would come to us, but it uh, has become accelerated by the online by the pandemic and we are much more familiar with the online activities and we are we will be able to create the synergy effect from online and offline hybrid events so this is the era post covid-19 era and uh, COVID-19 era is ending very soon, so we need to change ourselves. The education training system will also change. We will strengthen our online training system, and we would also develop further the offline, offline training. And that doesn't mean that we will stop doing the online training, ABS and Atomy Business School. The MBA course and four-year course are in almost done now. And among them, for the startup, a build up, level up, and jump up. So we have four years of courses. And what is more important for members is to take the third year course, level of course. On, so in April, we opened the, that course. So startup and build up course, actually, these are something that you already know. The first two years, are something are about something that you are already know so you can start from the third year and after 
uh, taking the course. And you can also take a look at the first grade and second grade um, course. You can see that this is a very basic uh, knowledge about Atomy that I uh, that I already know. But if you take a look at those uh, content, then you can also learn many things uh, because you can learn how to introduce Atomy to those newbies. And uh, we already started the third grade course and from this month, April. So we have many uh, students taking the course, the third year, third grade course. Actually, education, uh, teaching is changing. Education is changing. It is not about teaching. It is about learning. So uh, it is the main part of the education is not teacher. What is more important is student learning many new knowledges by themselves. And the benefit of learning system is that many uh, students can choose what they need, and they can also change the speed. For example, if you work really, really hard, if you don't really sleep, at all, then you can actually finish the ABS course within a month if you work really, 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 really hard day and night. But there are also some people who are actually um, doing other work. They don't really have many, many time. So they can actually take one course for one month so they can take their time, they can finish the course uh, in one year, so you can have your own speed. So after finishing completing the course, and an MBA course is uh, e equal equals to master's degree. And after completing the course, you can actually earn more money than those usual master's degree. Actually, those with master's degree, uh, for those with master's degree, earning a lot of money is not an easy job, but it's possible for Atomist MBA course. Many people uh, think that the forklift is very impressive, but that much money is something many leaders are uh, earning like every year. So maybe we should give you that that much cash with for lift, not just uh, sending sending you uh, sending the money to your bank account, because many people don't really know there are actually a lot of people earning that much money every year. I really envy them. So this is about the ABS course. You can learn many knowledge from the ABS course. And we provide a Korean language right now, but it will be uh, other languages will be available later on. So the training and education will be done automatically. Actually, at Atomy, I always say that just um, hang out first, and then after hanging out, you can start working. And with um, ABS and other training courses, being fully utilized, you will never uh, have to introduce Atomy on your own. The ABS would do it for you. Everything would become automatic. So you can uh, get, can be gathered together and offline. And you saw the rabbit today, right? You can watch those uh, performance. You can enjoy the time together. So rather than just doing the tra training, so you, we can have some a communication with each other, saying hello to each other, rather than just uh, education and training. So training would be done by the ABS, the online course, and the other things, those uh, emotional um, 
communication will be done by Success Academy and offline event. So in the future, you would tell your friends, the, the non-Atomians, then you would say, let's uh, go to, let's go and watch the performance. It's really, really uh, funny. It's interesting. And they would really uh, come to Atomy. So that way, the business spot would become, would also become automatic. And that's our goal. That will become absolute business. So we are in the course. We are on the way to that goal. So to realize that dream, to reach that goal, we need to work really, really hard right now. Leaders, if you are a leader, you should never sleep. As a leader, you don't really separate your time. If this is uh, the, this is for many people say work-life balance, but I don't, I don't really like the word. Many people say this is a new trend, this is a new concept, but it's been around, the, new, the word has been around there for many, many years, from many, many years ago. Many of my, many of my our parents would always say it is important to hang out rather than working hard, but how about their retirement life? Actually, uh, they didn't really work as a young people, as a young person, so they are now working. They're still working. At, they are very old, but they are still working. So from until 30 years old, you study, and uh, between 30 years old and 60 years old, you work, and after 60 years old, you should retire, right? But those young people from 30 year old and to 60 years old, they pursue work-life balance and they don't really work really hard. Then what does that mean? They, after the retirement age, they should work even harder. They cannot uh, take a rest. So I believe all uh, the people should work really, really hard for the 30 years. And then after that 30 years, you can actually have your work-life balance. Because you don't really have to work. You are 70 years old and you are still working. It's nonsense. It isn't a work-life balance. But I would say this is my own balance. Of course, that's right. I'm 70, but until the end of my life, I will work. And I saw many successful Christians did it. So I will take a rest in heaven. There, it can't really work. So here, I will work to the fullest. And the heaven, I can take a full rest for the rest of my second life. But here, in my first life, I will work until the end of my life. So it is really, really important to work harder as you, as you are when you are young. And I bel that's why I don't really like the term work-life balance. And at me, we have a new promotion, right? Semi sells master, right? Sesema. We call it Sesema. Or Panmesa, not Panmesa. I like the terms. So after becoming auto sales master, you can earn about uh, 1K or two, uh, 2K or 4K uh, dollars. But as a semi sales master, you can earn about 1K uh, dollars every month. To become semi sales, you need to have a, about 1.5 million PV 
on the boat flags. And as a semi salesmaster, you can earn about uh, about 1K dollars every month as a semi salesmaster. So it'll help. It'll make it easier for you to become sales master. So those who have uh, the customers with some groups of customers, they can become semi sales master, and they can earn some money. So those customers can become a leader. That way, we can increase the number of semi sales masters. And you can persuade many other people, your customers, uh, to start the business as a semi sales master. And that way, if you are a sales master, you can maintain your position e uh, in an easier way. And that way, you can also become auto sales master as well. So it is a win win system. That way, you can also. The sales, sales masters, the original sales masters would become the masters. That's what we expect from the early April. We started the system. We started the semi sales system. Now we have a lot of new groups uh, getting bigger and bigger. There are many people who are active in those uh, in the promotion activities. And as there are many people who are very active, but those, there are some people who are not taking any action, but it is really, really, really important to become very, very active with some new announcements from the company and with the semi sales promotion you should encourage your team members to actively participate in the system and you need to have a high expectation so you should think you should think in your mind and you should tell other people that semi sales master would be groundbreaking but if you don't really have any expectation the result will not be very good so if you don't do that, you will not see the true value of the semi sales promotion. So although you know become an imperial master, it seems too long away from sales master. But actually, this is the start. You will be able to get that ten one billion one price and you will drive your dream car just by starting with semi sales master because this is the first step to become successful in Atomi. So if you write before you are taking the challenge, you think this is impossible to become imperial master. How can I become an imperial master if I am just a semi sales master? It will take so long. If you have those kind of mindset, you won't be able to become an imperial master at last. You see, a lot of our imperial master, they have they're undergoing their hard times. They have literally living in poverty for a long long times but they have faith they have believe in atomy and they believe that they will become imperial master at last and now you can see they are living the their best life and also in the oversea branches you know when our imperial master when they are still working as a business Member, they don't even speak foreign language, they don't even speak English, but they still go to the US, the States, European countries to give out lectures. So if you don't have confidence in yourself, you don't believe you can do it, you know, I, I can't believe you guys will think like this. You have seen all these people become successful. 
So what are you hesitation? Why do you look down to yourself? You will never become successful if you look down on yourself. You have to trust yourself and you have to be smart. Trust yourself or else you will just stay in your li miserable life. We have our crown leaders here. We have our royal leaders here. You know, they seem so successful sitting here, right? But back then, they are just ordinary people. If they don't have the faith in them back then, will they be able to sit here now as a global leader? They are all ordinary people. They didn't receive good education. They are poor, and they were once poor, and they are have a lot of miserable accident in life. They have financial burdens, but still they believe in themselves, and they believe in what I said to them. So that's why they have become so successful. So it's. means that what I'm saying is true. You know, there are a lot of surface studies about how one's mental life thinking will change their actual situation. So if you have your imaginations, if you believe in yourself, this is the law of success, you will be able to become successful. And when you teach your partners about this, they will also be success and will become, will duplicate all the success experience. And this is the law of success. It was being proved already. It is not something just mentioned by old men. It was there are a lot of evidence proven that the law of success is true. And what is the core of the law of success? Is you have to trust yourself. But sometimes people will be afraid if they are thinking too much. They are have to, so they're too confident about themselves. They're afraid they will be failed in the future. But sometimes we don't have to focus on in the future. Because if you hesitate in this moment, you'll never succeed in the future. That's, I am very certified about this. When I was that poor, when we first started the Adami business, we don't even have an office. And I tell all these members that I'm going to give them 10 billion Korean won when they become imperial master. You know, do you think normal people hear that they will believe me? I'm a, such a poor, miserable, middle-aged man. But you know what? We did achieve all these miracles because we have faith in ourselves and we have faith in each other. And we have faith in Atomy. And some managing survey studies, they take Atomy as a sample to analyze and to uh, investigate how Atomy works. And there is a book, the name is Super Fuca Society Generation. So, a professor from Iwa Women's University, a very famous professor, majoring in economics, he write this book about Atomy. So you might think, what is Fuca? Fuca is a, a combination of volatile, uncertain, complex, and ambiguous. 
which means that our society is very, uh, the future is very unstable. So how can we solve this FUCA society? There are a lot of study about this, but these surveys, all these papers, is just theories. These are just based on some theoretical principles, some textbooks. But at me, we are a living sample. We are a living example. We have a lot of evidence to show that this is a module that can solve the future society. So, what is about the super fuca generation? All these like file, the volatile, the uncertainty, the complexity. You know, in this environment, how can we do the business and become successful? So, the key is to have a compass in hand. So now all these professors are studying about the superfuca society. And in Atomy, we use our management module, we use our system to prove that we are the next generation business. So this is not easy because all the achievements we have, the education program we designed, these are the evidence. So within the super fuca generation, what should we do? How can people overcome the difficulties? How can people run the business? So, Atomy will become the textbook for them. You know, I don't know if you guys realize I'm also a business uh, a business professor and I know some of you don't like to read but I really appreciate if you can read this book because there are a lot of useful information. Even if the content is a little bit difficult, you found yourself don't understand the things inside. But you have found it interesting because although the half, first half of this book is all about those theoretical uh, contents, it's very complicated, it's about the complexity of society. So the first half of the book will be very complicated, I know that. But, however, the second half of the book, which in the part of analyzing the FUCA society, the use atomy, the business model of atomy to explain things. So as you guys are so familiar with atomy, you will find the second half very interesting because you will see how the uh, scholars, the professors from those uh, famous university, how they would describe atomy and how they see atomy. And when you read the second half, you understand everything. You will also have confidence because Oh, you suddenly know what the first half was talking about. And you will be easily understanding all these theories, all these complicated words. 
And also by reading this book, you will understand how Atomy is doing and how many recognitions we're getting from not only the society, but from the uh, scholars and professors. And Atomy, all the things about Atomy written in this book, will be uh, very fascinating and you will see Atomy in the brand new aspect. So in the future, even if you don't have, uh, you didn't ever study about business or finance, but actually in our study feed, we have something like uh, sample analyzing. There are a lot of studies studied about Samsung, uh, Google, like all these famous companies. So there will be a lot of uh, professors analyzing how they become success. And now Atomy is also one of the samples. And also within the books, there will be a chapter talking about cherish the spirits. So 10 years ago, when I first built up this company, when I think about the keyword, the core of our business, I was thinking about spirit. So spirit is very important. And, but at that time, not a lot of businessmen would talk about things like this, like spirits, like fishing. And they found it very unfamiliar because it is a very difficult, con complicated concept. But however, this spirit is very important for every human, so as the corporation. So while I'm talking about spirit, there are human spirit and there are the spirits of the God. And also in the Bible, spirit is such an important concept. Yes, our society was changing, our, the world is changing, but what doesn't remain unchanged is the spirit of every human. It can bring us out of all the obstacles, they can solve the difficulty for us. So Adam, we want to act like a spirit to everyone so that they can find hope in the darkness. It is that's why we put cherished spirits in our model because we have to have the spirit in our heart, even if we're doing the business. And also in Atomy, we talk about the philosophy of cow and philosophy of babies. This is actually the same concept. So in Atomy, we don't treat our member as a tool to, for wealth or for we treat all the members as a part of us because everyone have their spirits. We have to respect everyone's spirit. Just like the philosophy of cow and philosophy of babies, the farmers will raise the cow because they want to get the milk before the mother who were raising the children, they raised them because of the spirits, because they love them. So when all these professors in university professors, they found 
enemy to become success in this Fuqa society is because of the uh, philosophy we have, we cherish the spirits. They are so surprised because no other corporation would talk about things like this. So now we are spreading our message to the world and people will recognize us because back then the MLM industry has such a black image for everyone. But Atomy overcome all these prejudices, we overcome all these bias, we break the bias. And we become, we go to another next level, a total different level with other companies. So we have to become number one in the world just by respecting every spirit of every human. We will not treat the grannies who is like running a small stalls as uh, the useless person, we will cherish their experience and help them to become the imperial master. And this is possible in Atomy. We have to become a auto sales master, we have to become auto sharing rules master, and we eventually will become imperial master. We have to have this kind of dream in our heart. We have to have all the big dreams in our heart, and we have to be crazy about it. So if you are crazy enough, you will be able to success and you'll be earning a million, 10 million. You have to grab this opportunity. This is not hard, it's not difficult. You have, we have to dream big. Don't talk about you don't believe yourself, you think you're not doing good enough. You are all the future imperial masters. You will become the most successful person among your friends. So think about those things. Now you might be, there are people rejecting us, there are people talking things, bad things about us doing the MLM business, but when you become a successful leader, when you become an imperial master, you don't care about the things people said. You can do anything you want. So all these small obstacles you're facing now, they will become nothing in the future when you become an imperial master. So when you know the law of success, which is to dream vividly in your heart, in your head, you will not care about what people said. You will only focus on how you're be going to become successful. So that's why we need a goal. We need a big dream. At first, when I established Atomy, I have this big dream in my head. Even though I was just driving a second-hand car, even I was just living in a rental house, but I told everyone with all my full confidence that I will be giving them 10 million won, 10, 1 billion won cash in cash if they become Imperial Master. See how successful they are now, my Imperial Masters. You must be paying a lot of tax these days, right? It's important, don't forget to pay your taxes. If you earn a lot, you also have to 
pay taxes. You know, you have to return part of your wealth to the society. So we must dream big. We want to pay a lot of taxes. No, it will be okay if you have a lot of money and you will be fine giving out your wealth back to the society. It doesn't affect your life because when you become successful, the money is not important anymore. So for me, I think personally, I think paying the taxes is the happiest time in the year for me because it means that you know, I become successful and I can return to the society and I can help others. So don't think that paying taxes is that is government taking your wealth away from you. You should think the other way. You're helping the others. Then you'll be very satisfied about it and you'll be very happy about yourself too. Because some people really hate paying taxes. They think someone take their money from them. But actually, that's not true. You know, it is fine to give back to the society. And also, after you pay your taxes, you can also make donations to compassion. You still have a lot of money to use for yourself. You will have a lot of money left for yourself. So for me personally, as you guys know, I will pay. I have to pay a lot of taxes. But still, I sponsor a thousand children from Compassion. Some people ask me, wow, a thousand children, would it be a little bit, uh, would it be a burden to your financial situation? But when I read their letters to me, I receive a thousand letters every year, and when I read them, everything just worth it. So I don't really think giving money to these children will become a burden, but I feel really satisfied. I'm very happy about it. So I believe the members here, you guys are sponsoring your children through compassion. And even though when I was poor, even though when Adam was not in a big scale, when we are just starting up, we used to donate part of our income to the children's who need help. But at that time, of course, we cannot uh, donate a large amount. But now, since we can, we have the ability to do this, so we should do it. And these days, I go to check on the Compassion and Atomy uh, homepage. I saw there are more and more people are sponsoring the children, and I was really, really happy to see it because I believe all of our members, they, we have a good heart. We like to serve in humility. And recently, we are become a part of CBMC which is a uh, Christian committee. So a lot of uh, Christian entrepreneurs, they group together and they uh, do volunteries. So we are now a part of them. And before when Korea is going to civil war, we receive a lot of help from this committee too. 
So as now we become a successful our com company has become successful, we would like to help the others too. And so that's why we are now very proudly to announce that we are part of them. And they asked me to become the vice president of Korea branch. So I said yes. So I have been always uh, promoting charity and serve in humility. So I'm very happy that I have another identity that I can uh, spread this message to more people. And I'm very happy that they chose me to become a vice president because they recognize how good Adam is doing now and they agree with our Christian-based philosophy. So I'm very happy to tell you guys about it. And tonight, you guys will be writing your life scenario. So this is very important. At first, I would like to ask all of you to write or update your life scenario every week. But since I believe mm, you need more time or you have to work, so I encourage you, you must update your life scenarios every month at least. And after you finish it, you have to tell your friends, you have to tell your families, you have to tell your partners about your dreams and your life goals. So some people might not you know, agree with what you want. And also some people, when you first met them, it's hard to just uh, open a topic about Atomy by telling them, oh, there is some absolute product, absolute price. But when you start with your dreams, you're telling them their goals, you're just like normal chatting. It will be more easy for them to understand Atomy and for more easily for them to attract to your stories that they are interested in listening to, listen to your life goals. And when you tell them your ultimate goal is to become an imperial master and you will get a uh, one billion won cash price and what kind of house, dream house you're going to live. So they will also have this sketch of vision about Atomy. And also uh, we want to go to different countries to travel and you would like to do voluntary work. So these are the things you should tell your friends and your families. And don't be shy. And you have to talk to your friends more frequently about it. And starting from the beginning, Till the end, you have to keep updating them about your lives. So how this is how uh, our life scenario works. So it's important to repeat, repeat updating your life scenario and repeat telling these people about your dreams. And you can tell them, start to tell them more about Atomy. So you can start uh, from small uh, stories, like uh, the Atomy has a really good product, like uh, toothbrushes. That's how many people say it is a, a good success uh, tip. But I don't really agree with that. You should not tell them about small stories. You should tell them big stories, like monthly income, $1 million. Actually, if you tell them about 
big uh, stories. They would take it as a small story, and as time goes by, they would uh, become more and more impressive about our vision. So it is important to story uh, to tell them the storytelling about the vision, and that way you can find consumers. That way you can find leaders. Of course, uh, in order to in order to have more leaders, include uh, more recruit more leaders, of course, you should first recruit consumers. Of course, uh, there is the other way around, like some people would go from leader, a leader to a consumer or the other way from consumer to a leader. But what is more important for the both cases is to tell them big stories. Of course, some people would say this is ridiculous, it is not realistic, but there are still some people who believe in the, believe in the vision. So the the story, the vision, is actually the shell of Paul. It is not that you can actually, no one knows whether there is the jewel in the shell, then what you should do is to gather all the shelves that you can it's not that you should be worried about uh, is there a jewel inside the shell no no way you shouldn't do that you should first gather all the different shellfish all the different shellfish and then later on you can actually find one jewel out of many shellfish oh there can be a diamonds under the ground you should give a try no one knows the future no one knows the result but you should at least give it a try and it is important to increase the possibility and you can you should approach 100 people 1000 people or 10000 people it doesn't really matter how many times you are rejected we have a lot of people in this nation. We have 50 million people in Korea. So you should give it a try. You should approach them. You should try to recruit them. It doesn't really matter if you are rejected. So you should contact many, as many as as many people as possible. You should approach as many people as possible. So telling them uh, about the Atme story is your job. Your job is not your job is not changing their mind. Your job is just telling them the story. Tell them the story, and you should be worried about the results. You should just tell the story and have a good sleep. And next day, you should tell the story to others. And that way, that person would be thinking about the story, not you. It is ever better to tell the story 10 times than just one time. Do you understand me? If you, you, you have all the friends and family members, you just tell them. Let's do the at me. Just tell them and forget, forget it, forget about it. And later on, you can repeat it. You just forget that you have told them the at, about at me. And that way you can recruit uh, people. And there are those people who were looking for a new business because the world is very, the instability in the world is growing, everything is not very stable, and there are still some people who are looking for this kind of business, then if you approach as many people as possible, then you will definitely be able to find that right person. You should tell many people about Atomy. And 
Many people are actually, many people doubt themselves. Many people doubt the atomic business after looking at those people who are earning like 5K or 10K dollars a month. But what you should do is to tell them, can you earn that much, like forever? Can you buy, even buy a house with that income? You should not envy them. You should doubt them. If you don't really earn, like, uh, 100K dollars a month after paying all the taxes, Can you buy, actually buy a house? If you earn like one million dollars a year, can you buy a house for your children? It's not enough. Then how about like 10K dollars a month or 5K dollars a month? Many ordinary people actually envy those salary men, but you should not envy them because it's not a... big money as an Atomian, what you should do is to set a higher goal. In your mind, you should set a goal. What you can imagine is something very, very realistic with even 1% of possibility. You can take on challenges, and that challenge is not something that you can achieve 100%. It is the goal, your dream. is not something about a very uh, something easy to achieve this is not an ideal dream all dreams and all goals all desired goals are very difficult to achieve on the way you might face a lot of difficulties and the top would be very, very high, and only one person out of 100 people would be able to achieve that dream. That is the true dream. So you should have a high goal. That's not because you can achieve that 100%. I tell you, you can earn $1 million with the forklift, and it is not actually And I told you this like several years ago. And I told you that I told you my dream about the forklift, not because I believed that it's uh, not because the dream was achievable 100%. It was because there was only there was a possibility, even if it's only 1%. So all the desired dreams are something very hard to achieve. And with that 1% possibility, if you work really, really hard, and if you believe in yourself, if you believe in the vision, then definitely you can make it uh, 100%. Those who are not successful, most of them actually see the dark side, not the bright side. They don't see the possibility, they see the impossible things. They see the downsides. That's why they become the failure. But what you should do, you should see the possibility. You can, what you can have in your mind is something that is very bright. The possibility, Atomy has already proved it. Thank you. Please give him a big hand. Thank you for your very impressive speech. His passion is really, really impressive. All those uh, who are in Zoom, you might uh, really want to be here, right? Hope, hope we can see each other in the O-Road next month. 구독, 좋아요, 눌러주세요.